Welcome to the Daily App Show. Today we have an application for your iPod, your iPhone, and your iPad called Time Lock. Now if we open up Time Lock, what it's going to show us is an intuitive alarm clock that we can see our current time and even tap and set alarms. Now this is the world's first unique security application because it hides a high security photo vault right behind an alarm clock. No one's going to know that there's a photo vault behind this. The way that you access your photo vault is to tap the button in the middle of the clock, which is going to reset the clock, and we have 59 seconds to input our passcode that we've set up. Once you first open the application, you're going to have to set up a passcode, and I've already done that, so I'm going to go ahead and enter in the passcode I've set. Once I've got it set to the right code, hit the middle button again, and it's going to unlock my photo vault. So right here, I have all the photos that I've imported from my camera roll, and what you need to do from here is once the photos are imported into time lock you'll want to delete them out of your camera roll that way they are in one secure location on your device so if I tap on one of these photos say right here in May 8th tap on that photo I can use the buttons in the bottom to scroll through the three photos for that date now if I hit the share button in the top right hand corner I can delete this photo save it back to my camera roll or even send it via an email and then I even have a photo up, a video up here in the top that I've imported as well that I can go ahead and play right inside Time Lock. Now there are a few settings here in the application. So if we tap on the settings, we can change some of the sounds such as indicators, open, close, safe, deletion, and self-destruction. We can turn these sounds on or off by sliding those sliders. Go ahead and come back out. We can change our passcode, which we can enter in our current passcode and then change it to a new one if we wanted to. We have a self-destruction feature which will allow us to have our time lock vault deleted after five unsuccessful attempts to log in. So if I go ahead and take activate, it's going to activate that. And then I can choose an erasing method which by default is going to be random data. Come back out, I have a uh, language selector that I can select the different languages for the application. I have the iFile feature which is really neat because I can turn this on and you see that I can import photos directly from my computer using my internet browser and go into this web address which is this IP address and I can transfer the files directly inside of Time Lock which will bypass my camera roll allowing me just to have the photos in my secure vault by themselves without having to go anywhere else on my device. So the way that we import photos will come back out into the main Time Lock. We'll hit the plus button in the top right hand corner and it's going to access if we like to do photo or video. So if I tap on photo, it's going to load up all the albums on my device and then I'm going to come to my camera roll. I'm just going to tap on all the photos I want and you see it's telling me how many I have selected in the top. I have 8 out of 25. When I'm ready, hit done and it's going to import those photos and bring them in to my main album and sort them by date here inside of time lock. And the same method is going to work for video. So if I hit the plus button, tap on video, it's going to show me all the videos I have. Tap on one, it's going to compress the video down and bring it inside the vault. And then again, what you would want to do is go back into your photos application, make sure and delete those out of your camera roll because now they're going to live inside of time lock where then if you tap on one again, you can always export it back out to your camera roll if you'd like to do so in here in your photo vault. So once again, this application is called Time Lock. If you like it, be sure and pick it up in the App Store today.